Hey everyone, welcome to another one of my live recordings. Today I'm going to be testing Jacerator. It's an awful deck, and I'm playing an awful version of it, but eh, let's see what happens. I obviously can't keep a one lander. I could, I'm not going to. Life land, fetch land, two archive traps, and a howling mine. I like it a lot. Not only do I have the two Archive Traps, but he opens up with a Terramorphic Expanse. That's 20 cards off the top of his deck right off the bat. I think... I'll follow suit. Correct it. That's no good. Hmm. I'm gonna have to fix my triggers. Hope they didn't cost me the game. Two forests and a bird. Could be anything so far. I found after playtesting, normally, that I want to hold on to my Howling Mines until I can back it up with some counter magic, but it's just not so much necessary when all he's packing is green. Banking on the fact that nobody main boars naturalizes nowadays. Now the deck's also referred to as Turbo Fog from time to time, even though that specific version has kind of fallen off. The reason for that is all the Angel Song, Fog, Safe Passage effects, but in reality, Kabira Crossroads and the Expeditions, any kind of life gain is equivalent to a fog. So I'm just as happy with the crossroads. Still have mana open for safe passage, so I'll see what's coming down the pipe. That's ugly. That is really ugly. Some life gain land, and... Let it go. Hopefully his tokens don't start coming out of the gate too fast. I'm more worried about that Ant Queen swinging in. Might just let the first attack go through. Maybe not. Yeah, no reason. Just as 4 extra life gain is basically negated half an attack, dropping from 24 to 17 is not too bad. And with the font and the Howling Mine in play, hopefully drawing into some prevention magic won't be too hard. 
the reason I'm unhappy with my version of this deck is because it's not running time warps. Instead, I have Archmage Ascensions, which, once they're active, are actually really fun. You stop drawing. Start tutoring. Okay, so there's Rampant Growth. I obviously missed it the first time around. Now that I'm aware, start skimming some cards. One more time. Five turns into the game, but he's already down to 16 cards. This deck really is effective when it works. Just has to work. That's irritating. But I will go ahead and... everything I got. I'm assuming the worst he can do to me next turn is swing in for another 7, which I can survive. 